A developing story back here at home after three people are found dead in Tolleson, two of them children. This happening in a home near 91st Avenue in Van Buren. ABC 15's Pete Serratos joins us live from the scene now. And Pete, uh, what are investigators revealing here? Well, Steve, it looks like police entered the home about an hour ago, and as you can see, it's still a very active scene there. And now we know that it was a murder-suicide with the 45-year-old adult male dying from a self-inflicted gunshot wound to the head and the two children, ages 8 and 6, dying from gunshot wounds as well. We want to show you some video from earlier. It's been an emotional scene this morning with neighbors hugging and crying on each other's shoulders. Many of them are still waiting outside right now as police investigate the situation, but police do tell us that they received a call around 10 a.m. from a relative who found the deceased bodies inside of that Tolleson home this morning. To their knowledge, the mother of the kids was not present, and they haven't confirmed which family member actually made the 911 call. And we spoke with neighbors who heard a loud scream outside of the home this morning around the same time that police got the phone call, and now we know why. He says, what's going on? And, but then we didn't see anybody outside. Everybody was inside. So we walked wet back inside, and then next thing we know, we looked outside, there's cops all over the place, so we kind of hear, why was she screaming? And we spoke to neighbors, and they said they did hear uh, what sounded like gunshots and fireworks last night, but of course, they thought it was normal because it was New Year's Eve. But there's still two questions that the PD, they're still trying to figure out exactly what the motive was and when this all took place. And of course, we'll keep you up to date on all the details right here on ABC 15. Yeah, I'm sure family members have a lot of questions as to just why here. Thank you, Pete.